All right, folks, welcome back. Today we're going bargain hunting for golf clubs at three major golf retailers. It's usually a really good time of year to go look for used clubs because everybody's trading them in, but never know what you're going to find, so... Let's go find it. Let's go find it. Again, things started off, Edwin Watts. Man, it gives me every time how many used iron sets they have in here. This is literally just the left-handed and senior flex section. We've got some Bridgestone JGRs right here, five iron all the way down to the approach wedge, $360 on that. Not a terrible deal. Bridgestone irons, if you can find them, they're getting hard to find. Definitely some soft forgings. Got some Adam's Idea, the blues. 7 iron through pitching wedge for 150. Got a hybrid set missing the uh, hybrids. Got, asterisk. Yeah, asterisk. We got the uh, Titleist T200s for 890. Some tailor made stealths in here. All oh, these things are super easy to hit, and you can usually get a good deal on these. The Cleveland Launcher XLs, 5 iron all the way down to the D wedge, $800 on those. Got some PXG 0211s. These are uh, not the newest ones, but the last model, I think. $500. What else we got over here? Got some Wilson D350s. Those things are really easy to hit. What else we got over here? Some Two Ridge Bazookas way back there, $170. What are these, some Hanmas? I've never seen that model of Hanmas, $350 on that. Got the T-World, those are the Rose prototype ones, mm -hmm. $800 on that. The thing you gotta look out for those is there's not a huge resale value on these because they were faked like crazy. So it kind of brought the value down and then they dropped, or they parted ways mutually, uh, Hanma and uh, Justin Rose. PSI's on there. $299 is a pretty good deal on that. Got the P770s for $560. X24 Hots, $230. Yeah, there's just like so many used irons. Definitely the most uh, in town. Uh, I got some CB716s for $700. What else we got over here? Some more PXGs. I got a bunch of PXGs. Got the Srixons. I think this is this 565s. Whoa, all oh, those are Miyazaki shafts in there. $500 on that. It's a pretty good deal. Yeah. Those are super, uh, for like looks, a combination of looks and forgiveness. Those are definitely worth picking up. Got the Strixon staff bags over here too. Oh, Mizuno MP30s. I always wanted a, a combo set of the MP30s and MP33s. And then I finally like kind of made one. And the MP33 blades were easier to hit than the yeah. MP30s. It was kind of funny. All right. Oh, look at these. Got some Yoras. Those things are stunning. I wonder what the condition of these. Oh man, these are actually pretty good. Pretty good. If we found some uh, baby blades, I would pay whatever they were asking. Oh, we got some uh, Mizuno MP68s for $250. That's a really good deal. Let's see what condition they're in. Oh, it's actually pretty good condition. Those are definitely a deal. Don't need them though, but let's check out the uh, woods and the wedges. Whoa, it looks like they sorted everything out by brand. Got the TaylorMades, got the Callaways and the Titleist. Makes it a little bit uh, easier. We got the uh, 2017 TaylorMade M, $160 on that. See how much the uh, TaylorMade Stealths are going for. Oh, this is a demo one, $480 on that one. Oh, we got a, a goofy old uh, Callaway Classic. This is the, uh, speaking of uh, TaylorMade Stealth, the uh, carbon one. This was like the first carbon driver that I remember <laughs> going for $100. That's kind of uh, goofy. This thing felt and sounded super weird at the time. The whole head is basically a uh, carbon. You can see the carbon fiber all is around. This point? I think Why? it might actually be vintage. <laughs> yeah, those came out like right after the ERCs, which, uh, uh, never mind. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna date it. I probably said that one wrong. But we got the Callaway X2 Hot right here, going for 140. Got a bunch of newer stuff. Usually the prices on the newer stuff are almost at retail, so it's not really worth checking out. This one oh, looks like an evil villain to me. Yeah, that does look pretty uh, evil. <laughs> the uh, LTD Cobra. This was actually the driver that Bryson had to use for a while because the uh, Cobra faces kept on collapsing on him. So those have held their value uh, pretty well. Oh, we got an old school Adams. I actually use this, the Redline RPM. Mm -hmm. This thing was super forgiving, but uh, not very uh, long. Oh, this thing has been dented like crazy. I think got the uh, Pro, yeah, I had that shaft in there yeah. too, the Pro Launch Blue. Oh, here we go. Another Nick Ant 40X. Some brands that are no longer with us. $59 on that. Yeah, Nick Ant was one of the first ones to have interchangeable weights. Mm -hmm. Got an old school Ping Rapture. This is the V2. No, the regular first one. Another one of, the, I think this was the first uh, carbon. We're going all all over with the uh, carbon. The first composite ping driver. Got an Adam Speedline Fast 12. For 50? That's not a bad deal on that. Got a bunch of PXGs over here. Oh, oh. Ooh, I was trying to cut you off. Which, <laughs> we got the 0811XF. We actually just found the uh, proto version of this and we both hit it really good. Mm -hmm. And we're about as far away in swing speeds as you could possibly get. We both hit it really good. Let's check out the uh, Fairway Woods over here. Got a stuff. Fairway Wood going for 280 King Cobra SE going for 170 That's not a bad deal on that. Oh, we got another. <laughs> Let's get drawn to the old school ones. Aldi Law Ed V Shaft and a Sonar Tech, man. Yeah. Let's check out the wedges. 
Oh, we got a Ping Tour W. I just switched to the Ping S59 wedges and I've literally been looking at these. I've seen it in your eBay search history. Yeah, my eBay search history is uh, full of uh, yes. <laughs> Ping Tour wedges and the Ping I wedges. $40 on that Project X shaft. Okay. Blue dot, that is absolutely perfect for me. If we find another one of these, we got the uh, whole uh, S59 and wedge set up, good to go. Mm -hmm. Got some pink glide wedges over here. Got a pink custom edition, I SM8. One, the custom, like, the Funfetti confetti. Yeah, Funfetti right? glide <laughs> wedge right there. Oh, here we go, we got the F58 of the nice. uh, Tour W. And the blue dot, oh, that's crazy. Also $40. I think this is the black one, and then that one's like this, I forget what their finishes Finish, are called, yeah. but. 58 and 54 definitely going to uh, add those to the uh yeah i like that better. shopping cart i don't that's know where deal. i was going with that yes. yeah <laughs> but uh, definitely some uh, good deals in here you don't have to pay for shipping that's what you're yeah don't have to pay for shipping let's right. go check out the uh, putters nothing crazy in terms of the putters but this might be the most sick putters that i have ever seen literally sick putters that was almost funny yeah i tried a dad joke didn't work out you know how my dad jokes work out we got one two three of the sick putters we got a bet nardi i think this is actually the model that they just uh, sold at costco some like vendor like sold them to costco and they weren't supposed to and then they all got mad at each other kind of a weird story 260 dollars. we'll link to that in the uh, description it's kind of a bizarre story basically one of their vendors like sold it to costco because they couldn't sell them wherever they were and then uh, really ben already got mad that they were at costco the putter is very nice so that's yeah the I'm putter gonna... is uh, pretty nice to uh, say the least got a bunch of uh, even rolls over here don't know if we're going to pick up a putter, but we're definitely going to pick up these uh, two wedges. Yep. We'll meet you at the next spot. Next stop, PGA Tour Superstore. Dang, I can't believe these are still in here. A combo set left-handed, the Adams Idea A7. They're only $99. Got the Pro Force V2 shafts in there. And I thought those would have definitely got picked yeah. up. Still, these are here too. The uh, ZB Forge Titleist combo sets, $95 on that one. The fact that they even have five sets yeah, that's of lefty irons. Five uh, lefty iron sets. It's like a uh, dream for lefties. Got some TaylorMade R9s going for $134. It's a pretty good deal. If these were the TPs, I'd consider picking these up. And they've got some uh, wear on those. Got a Titleist T100s. What do you got over there? Uh, oh, R7 for yeah. 110. That's a pretty good deal yeah. on that too. What shafts on there? Stock shafts. Oh, they still got the original grips on there in really good condition. Those things have like never been used. Uh -huh. Huh. What else do we got over here? Some P770s. Oh, we got the uh, combo set P7 MBs and the P7MCs. How much is that going for? 680. Got the KBS Tour shafts in there. That's a really good deal on that. Got some AP1s, 399. That's a really good deal. Those have held their value really well since they got rid of those. What else we got over here? Oh, we got a premium pre owned of the TSI2. Don't know what premium pre owned means. $500 on that. That's a little, that little might be steep. Like issue. Yeah, we got a TaylorMade M6 for 150 Oh, the mini driver. For 200. 200. That's definitely the least I've ever seen mm -hmm. the uh, TaylorMade Mini Driver for. Usually those are like 350 still. Also, how is this guy? Yeah, still the here Nicholas too? is still in here. 2199. 20, oh, they got uh, full sets in here. I've never seen full no. sets used. Got the Zexio with the uh, Huntington Beach Putter. Oh, they got two sets of those. Yeah. Just the back. How much are these? Uh, 1300. I have no idea how much those no. uh, resell <laughs> for. But what else do we got back here? Oh, I got some more Zexio, got a Wilson D9, Epic Flash. I still got the Walter Hagen in here too for $29.99. That's like a little overpriced, surprisingly. Oh, you got a Ping G30? Yeah, for $32.99. $32.99, that's yeah. a really good deal. Stock shaft in there, got upgraded that grip. That like 100 Yeah, these things were going for 100 forever. Mm -hmm. Still in pretty good condition. It's got a little uh, wear on the sole. Yeah, but that just happens. Might actually try that out for myself. Mm -hmm. Oh, we got some uh, Strixon ZX Utilities. On demo, going for 110. Got the Ping G425 crossovers, going for 190. But yeah, the oh the blue, blue yeah the blue Mizuno T20s. Those are 45. pretty cool. Oh, fish. check these out. The Z's. I think these are the ones with like the removable. Yeah, the removable faces. You're supposed to be able to like interchange the faces so that they were always like very good, but they kind of felt weird. Oh, this is definitely the person who had the R9. It's got the same weird wear on there. How much are they going for? 12.99. That's Let's a pretty. See, uh, the illegal one. The illegal one. Oh, the, uh, so what is it? Spin Doctor. Spin Doctor. It was Doctor something. Yeah, Doctor uh, something. <laughs> doctor something. All right, got a bunch of lefties. Oh, the TaylorMade V-Still is in here. Lefties. This is the uh, PJ Tour Superstore in Orlando. There's definitely some good stuff in here. Oh, Super budget. A, like a used kids club. Used junior club going yeah. for $50 US kids. Huh. Mm, let's go That's check out one. the putters, but definitely getting the uh, Ping G30. Oh, yeah. Whoa, these bags are cool. There's another Zexio. This is like stores only Zexio. Plus a complete set, 3,000 bucks. That's nice. I was gonna That's say $3,000 nice. <laughs> for a bag is a little much, but 
Well, it better be nice for them. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, let's go check out the putters. Not much going on in terms of the putters other than this $22 Cleveland. I think this is the Elevado. Hey, yeah, Elevado. The but, grip alone is a Yeah, it's an arm lock grip and it's only like 31 inches long. So it's like a kid using an arm lock grip or they just had that grip lying around. Shelly style. Yeah, tabletop. tabletop. That's kind of goofy, but uh, definitely going to get the Ping G30. Mm -hmm. Let me shut the next spot. Next stop, Golf Galaxy. Whoa, tons of iron sets in here. This is the most I've ever seen. Yeah, it's probably the most we've ever seen in here. A lot of them are upside down. So we'll check that out here in a second. But let's see if we can find some good deals on the drivers. Well, we got an old school Ping G30 with some lead tape on there going for $205. Got the Wilson D9 going for $190. If you're going to buy something brand new, I definitely uh, recommend the Wilsons. They're a little bit less expensive than the, their competitors and equally as good. We got a uh, TaylorMade M2 2017, $230 on that one. The M2s. We say it every time, but the prices are insane on them. Oh, we got a uh, classic over there, a Highbor XLS. For $24.99. 24, oh, that's a 13 degree. Oh, nice. I don't know if VJ used that model, but he used a lot of the uh, Highbor stuff. Mm -hmm. What else we got over here? Oh, this is cool. We got a Rad Speed Tour going for, <laughs> it's not going to be, a, yeah, $225. I think Whoa. I, this might be the newest, lowest we've ever found. $9.99 for a TaylorMade Yeah, that is definitely going to uh, set the record for the lowest <laughs> price club ever at a uh, Golf Galaxy. $9.99. I wonder if the register goes any lower for uh, clubs. I don't know. I've Usually it's like $12.99 mm -hmm. is the lowest we'll see, and that's at PJ Tour Superstore. Yeah. I think that might be a new record, like you said. Oh, we got a uh, Callaway Diablo Octane. This is kind of similar to the one that Hendrick Stenson used for a long time, $30 on that one got a multi-compound grip in good condition it's almost worth more than the club itself yeah. see so we got in terms of the wedges oh man this wilson staff model super good looking oh it's only 65 dollars man that is a really good deal dynamic gold 120 in there ah uh, the face is kind of messed up all right let's see if there's any lefty love then we'll go over the uh, irons because they're all upside down it's really annoying to uh, go through them on camera yeah tons of lefties let's see how much the uh, lefty M2 is going for 2016, 165. Not a bad deal on that. Let's see if there's a difference in price lefty to a righty. Yep. 229, yeah, it was about the same price for the yeah. uh, 2017 M2 over there, right-handed. Let's see, quick look at the uh, irons. Got the ones that are facing us. We don't have to barrel through them. $660 for some Sim 2s. What else we got over here? Some Rogues going for, yeah, the grips are pretty cool, 620. We'll let you know if you find any good deals on the irons. We'll also check out the uh, putters. I'm definitely getting that. Yeah, definitely getting that. 16 degree, that thing's gonna be a rocket launcher. Yeah. I had a 16 degree of the uh, TaylorMade Rescue TP. Mm -hmm. That thing, a little bit too much club for me. We'll see if we can hit the non-TP one. Yeah. No real deals on the irons and not a ton of putters to choose from. We got one of the new Cobras for 230, a bunch of TaylorMade Spiders. Got a few Scotty Camerons in here. I think this is the Sonoma, $235. Oh, look at this. This is Scotty Cameron Newport 1.5 Studio. Select that thing. Oh man, that is one of my bucket list putters. I love that hosel structure. It's kind of like the uh, Ping Answer 3. Oh man, how much is it going for? You have I'm to look. Scared. Yeah, I'm scared to look. That's actually really good. Oh man, I've never seen that below 250. <laughs> that is a crazy deal on that. Still can't beat mine, but that's pretty Yeah, good your deal is a little bit more uh, <laughs> economical, but yes. that thing, oh my goodness, that is amazing. Uh -huh. Definitely picking that up. Got a super strong grip on there. Sweet. That's amazing. All right, folks, made it out to the golf course. Super excited to try everything out. Still can't believe we got that Scotty Cameron for that so was crazy. treat. crazy. Yeah, that was crazy. Almost as crazy as the fact that we got 1,000 subscribers in the first 24 <laughs> hours guys. on our uh, new channel. We haven't even posted a video no. on that, so stay tuned for that. We'll leave the link in the description to that. Lots of uh, cool stuff. Mm -hmm. Also, we're playing at a new course today, and Ashley's playing with her own clubs. I don't remember what they look like. Yeah, you know what that means. We're going to play a little <laughs> match. We haven't done that in a while because yeah. Ashley beat me like 20 times in a row. So Yeah, you got tired of it. I'm sorry. Uh, yeah, well, I'm, I'm going to get tired of it again. <laughs> because you always win, yes. but they're going to play a little three-hole match. Winner gets to uh, choose the treat, mm -hmm. and we're out here at a new course, Cranes Bend. This is that Orange Lake Resort. It's like mm -hmm. right next to Disney World. Never played here before, so oh, it really should be cool. uh, pretty uh, interesting. What do you want to do? You want to do two par threes, then a par four, or two par fours and a par three? Mm, well, I still got to stroke a hole, so let's do the par threes. Yeah, so stroke a hole goes pretty uh, <laughs> long ways on a par three, yes. but uh, first hole here for me is about 114 yards, so I'll go with one of those wedges, mm -hmm. and then you probably have, well, it doesn't matter, you're using your own clubs. Whatever I got. Yeah, but uh, let us know who you're rooting for. Also, thanks once again for the support yes. on the uh, new channel. Link in the description, but uh, let's see who wins. I'm ready. Are you? <laughs> I'm ready to go. I'm ready to lose once again. <laughs> oh, that felt so good. Get in, get in. 
Oh! Nice shot. Man, that thing felt so good. I think it might be a little bit further away than I thought, but I think we got about like six feet. Ashley's got about 80 yards. What are you going with? Uh, pitching wedge, but I also need a golf ball. Yeah. <laughs> it's usually <laughs> kind of useful. important. <laughs> usually useful. Yeah. Oh, go, 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 go. That's right on line. Oh! Well, luckily I have one stroke because that thing was right on line, but way too short. But then again, even though John's very close, it's still John putting, so might have more than one stroke. That's the reward I get for getting Ashley's putter. I get trash talked. Also, the ball is actually closer than I thought it was, too. Yeah, it is. Sorry. Oh, go, 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 go. Man, you've been right out live both shots, but actually that rolled out pretty good. Yeah, that was pretty good. Yeah, that rolled perfectly. Oh, nice. stuck in the left. All right, Ashley's got a putt to tie. What a putt. Oh, we'll count that. We leave the pin, <laughs> pin in so you guys can see it. Yes. But that was definitely uh, good. <sighs> Tied going through one. <laughs> All right, next hole is 120 yards. I'm going with a wedge. And then from your tee, actually, you don't have that much of an advantage on this one. No. Probably see a uh, nine iron. Probably. All right, even through one. Ooh, Oof. just off. Oh, man. Hole in one time. Oh. oh man, you're inside mine. I pulled mine a little bit. I yeah. didn't realize that the wind was gonna come off the uh, mm -hmm. lake over there. That one kinda... felt better too. I actually like moved my hips. What are you supposed to do? <laughs> <laughs> we'll throw that in the intro, Ashley <laughs> dancing. Sorry. <laughs> All right, just missed the green. Usually I would chip this, but when you got a Scotty camera, you might as well mess around with it. Plus, when in doubt, put it out. <laughs> oh man. I broke way more than I thought. That was still pretty good. I got you stymied. World's greatest putter to go one up. Got it surrounded. Yeah, I think that, yeah, yours is for par, mine's for par, so this is for the win. Cool. Cool for you. <laughs> <laughs> you were wise to choose the two par threes. No, no. dummy. <laughs> yours is good though. Thanks. You're welcome. Well, I've already lost the hole. <laughs> <laughs> All right, no surprise here. Ashley is one up. Next hole is about 360 yards from my tee. I'm going to be going with the uh, super low lofted rescue mid 16 degrees. What are you going to go? You can go with driver. Driver, for sure. <laughs> I might hit this almost as far as my driver if I get it off the ground. Yeah. All right, I think there's water to the left hand side of the green and short. So I'm going to try and play a hook and hopefully stay to the right of that. Oh, hopefully it's short of it. That was right on the water's edge. Oh yeah, now I see it. I eh, guess we'll find out. <laughs> I was so worried when you were lined up. You were like lined up in the water to the left. It just played like a perfect little cut. It worked. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, still need to work on my alignments and my hips and lots of other things, but it actually turned out pretty good. Yeah, that was pretty good. Yeah, and I think I'm just gonna hit my five hybrid until I make the green, so. Perfect strategy. Yes. Also, I'm still not sure if my ball reached the water or not, yeah. so I could be out of this hole already. Yeah, well. Five hybrids to come. To come. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how it's working. Like, your aim's so far left that it's just going way to the right. We'll I think I defy science on that one. <laughs> little raid session two and two here. Yes, please. Still not sure if my ball is in the water. This could be moot point at this time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, he got over the water. That was an intimidating <laughs> shot. Oh, uh, you're right by the car pass, so you'll be able to take relief from there. Oh, uh, got a case of the rights for sure. Also, my ball over there just like plugged. Yeah, yeah, I think it would have uh, reached the water if it didn't plug. Well, there you go. Luckily it rained. Expert analysis, as usual for me. <laughs> yep. Somehow I've had almost exactly 100 yards for all of these wedge shots. Yeah, it somehow not... worked out perfectly. Uh-huh. Nice. Oh, just short. There's a little bit of an elevated green. Yeah, Dang, look at how wet it was there. That divot is insane. Oh, that's impressive. We will repair that though. Yeah, I'll repair that here in a second. Oh, what a shot. Oh, stay on. The cops are here for you because you lied. You didn't hit a five hybrid. Oh, I'm sorry. That was such a good shot though. Thank you. All right, Ashley's got a somewhat makeable putt for bogey, which is a net par. And then I have a very long putt for birdie. So with my putting prowess, as Ashley has already made fun of. <laughs> It's about even right here. Yep. All right, I think this one is swinging way to the left. Hopefully starts, nope, that was basically dead straight. Oh, it's trying though. It tried. Ashley to win the match. Perfect pace. Oh man, these greens just don't break as much as they look like they're yeah, going to. Yeah, we haven't gotten used to them yet. Yeah, all right, I got this one for par. 
and you got yours for what is yours for Some double for bogey yeah yeah so i gotta make this one yep and then still gonna lose <laughs> honor boom nice all right yours is good you win thank you <laughs> oh no wait so if i got par and you got double that means i won so we're tied wait i thought mine was just bogey not double that one was for bogey Ah, oh, shucks. Uh oh we're tied. We'll have a closest to the pin challenge. Okay, cool. Well, how about that? That could not work out any better for you. We are tied, and the uh, closest to the pin competition is going to be 184 from my tee and 126 from your tee. Also, did you notice there's, like, nature plaques? Oh, wow. My... Oh, that one's Micteria missing. Americana. Oh, no. Someone Mystery. St someone stole the uh, little photo No one's in there. camouflage. That's why. Yeah. <laughs> That's pretty good camo. <laughs> I'm going to go with... Oh, I gotta keep with the uh, challenge. I gotta go with the uh, Ping G4. Nice. G400, I was gonna say, but the uh, <laughs> Ping G30 4 hybrid. Well, this could not be a harder shot. Usually, when I try and take uh, stuff off the club, I'll hit a big fade, but there's trees right there. Hmm. It's like a front pin location over water. Did you plan this? No, this was unintentional. Uh, I'm still gonna go. I'm just gonna go with a massive cut. Got it over the tree. Right at oh, that it. Looks sit, good, sit, 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 Oh! Ooh. It looks like it landed in the bunker, but there's just sand on that green. Yeah. And how I've been playing, that could be good. All right, I think mine's probably about 15 feet. Ashley's got 126 yards, and we're given the stroke even on this. So you get to hit your shot and then one more. <laughs> I'm okay with this. We set these things up so Ashley wins. You guys know that. <laughs> I need confidence builder for the rest of my game. <laughs> we need to spend time on the race. Yes, also, we do. I need to hit that 180 yard uh, four hybrid every single time. That was amazing for me. Also, you have to be my caddy too, because I don't know what I should hit from 126. here. 126. Uh, you go with the five hybrid, because you have to carry it over the water. Cool. And then you got another shot to play with. Thanks, caddy. <laughs> Oh, a little strategery. Ashley said that she's going with a six iron to avoid the water. And I'm not in the water. <laughs> you don't need me as a caddy. <laughs> oh, look at this, getting closer. It's rolling down there. Oh, nice. There you go. Car path for relief. You got a perfect angle now. <laughs> Mine is a little bit further away than we thought. Ashley has taken a pretty generous relief from the uh, car path. Let's see what she can do. Comment below who you're rooting for. I'm definitely rooting for Ashley. Oh, oh that not gonna be enough. I thought she was gonna hit the hill and bounce over. Shuck. Luckily, we were both uh, talking and we both wanted the same treat, so we're both winners. You guys have to hit the like button for the dedication on this video. Although, now that I think about it, we didn't say what we were gonna get, so. We could have just lied. We could have just lied about the treat. Oh, but I don't think the hard stuff's gonna come down for a while. <laughs> there you go, we got a Caddyshack reference. We are good to go on the uh, video. Also, we're not even halfway there. That's Spaceship uh, Earth at Epcot and also known as the great big golf ball. Yes. And we're going to Germany. We're I'm in it. All the way to Germany. Our feet are already soaked. We're all good to go. That, look, ankle high puddle right there. <laughs> we're good to go. Look, it's flooding. Oh, also, these shoes are waterproof to a point. Yeah. We've reached that point. Oh, there's lightning. We should probably put this phone away. Yeah. We'll meet you with our treat. Hopefully. Also, if you want to see uh, more Disney, we're not going to do just Disney. We're going to do whatever we want. Just walking around yeah. randomly in the rain. New channel. Is this good content? <laughs> Hopefully. Really, this is the channel. We just walk around in the rain. Yes. And there it is. It literally just stopped raining as soon as we got this. Yeah. We could have waited 10 minutes in the car and been fine. Also, I asked for extra vanilla sauce and they, they delivered. Yeah, extra icing. Pretzel bread pudding, $4.95. It's inside. I didn't really realize that until like a couple of months ago. There's a little booth inside the beer garden restaurant right before you get there. Mm -hmm. And they have got a seasonal thing for food and wine. And Pretzel bread pudding. So good. Wow. That looks amazing. It was funny, we both wanted the same thing. You lost and I won, and we both were like, I want the same thing. Also, I really need to go to the driving range. <laughs> <laughs> Just as good as you remember? Every time. Oh, yeah. Also, the raindrops keep hitting the uh, camera, so it's like, do you want to delete this video? And hopefully nothing got deleted, <laughs> hopefully and hopefully we not. filmed it in the right, like, I think it's like switching between 1 and 0. 0.5. Oh, that's exciting. At least it's waterproof. Unlike my shoes. Well, here we go. I don't know how they do it. It's so soft on the inside. It's basically just like pretzel bread, Cinnabon had a baby. Yeah, that's a good description of it. But it's so good, check that out. Oh yeah, yeah. It's funny, when you ask for extra icing, they all are like, what do we do? And so they're just like sitting there, just usually like they're the, laughing. They're they laughing the whole time. It's amazing. Oh, right, here we go. Oh. <laughs> Every time, I don't know how to do it. It's so good. 
it's cheaper than a thirty-five dollar churro too. Yes, yes it is. Well, hope you guys did like this video. Like, button, and subscribe, and and we'll see you next time. See you next time. I don't know how that Scotty camera was so cheap. I think it might have been because there was a little bit of paint missing on one of the uh, three dots. Oh. They just marked it down. Huh. That cutter usually goes for like two fifty and above. Yeah, that is crazy. There we go. I'm just gonna keep talking so I can keep eating more. <laughs> I think you deserve it. <laughs> oh, if you win, I get an extra bite. There you go. There you go. We'll see you next time. Bye guys. Subscribe to the new channel. We'll see you next time. Hopefully we dry out eventually. You're like, just keep filming so I can keep eating. Oh, here you go. You get the center. Oh, the good part. I know not to mess with Ashley in the center. <laughs> oh, lightning. It stopped oh. raining, but now we got lightning. Oh, got it. Oh, man. Look at that. That's, That's the, the bite. bite. That is the bite. All in. This is not going to be ladylike. Oh, thunder. So good. So good. Ending with a bang. <laughs> <laughs>